possibly get murdered again. I'm gonna hopefully... I'm gonna hope for the best and say that second time's a charm. Because I don't want to do this three times. So was it up these stairs right here or was it further? Yeah, right here. Okay. Here we go. Round two. Hello, Veril. So I'm just gonna skip through all this dialogue. I've seen it. And if I'm, if I'm not mistaken, there's actually quite a bit. Blah 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 blah. Blah 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 blah. Oh, what's my cat want? Did you want to come up here with me? Oh, yeah. going to the couch. Okay. Oh boy. What? Did you just come back over here? All right, I'm gonna bring my cat up here with me. He's being, uh, he's in one of his moods. He's very, oh, now he's walking away again. All right, <laughs> never mind. How much more text is there? I can't remember. It's a lot of dialogue to skip through, though. <laughs> well, hopefully... Hopefully this goes better this time. I mean, for starters, I am sober this time. <laughs> Keep fighting! So, if I recall, the first form isn't that hard. And the second one wasn't until that really, really strong attack. Like, I was surviving. But then he went and killed three people all at once. Yeah, 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 come on. So, if I lose again, I'll probably just open this in a... Uh, in RPG Maker and just delete all the text so I can just come here and just restart the fight right away. Just to save time. Alright. Uh, uh, what did, what, what did, what did Ephium say? I think he was talking with these. First off, let's do that, I guess. Uh, I'll, I'll try to make him bleed. Corrosion. Piercing light. Oh, I shouldn't do that with... Yeah. Okay, that's not effective. Oh, covered in acid. Good. And bleeding. Uh Let's try Toxin. I'll heal this turn. It's probably a good idea. Um, okay. Now I can do a buff. Agility! Yeah, 
Yeah, I mean, this form puts with some good damage at times, but I don't find it that hard, so... So I just did agility, let's do defense. Ah. Whoa, that was only one person. Oh well. And that was not fair. <laughs> okay, they can just attack, they're fine. Uh let's do Fairy light. Ow. So I want to make sure that Sus and Sando may mostly attack because the damage is fine right now anyway. I just don't want to worry about having to heal too much stuff at the start of the next fight. Uh, yeah, I'll do that. He does magic too, so. Oh, that was quick. Was it that fast last time? was very, very fast, I felt. Oh, well, alright. Second form. Let's see how this goes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god, Leaf Up! Right off the bat, 66 HP! <laughs> oh my god. That did nothing. I should probably heal. That didn't work either. Yor is silenced, go figure. Um. So I have the Heaven Cus Cuisine as a backup for sure. I can do that. I don't. Oh, oh! What I should be doing right now is. That. There. Ah!
Ow. Still not really getting time to buff with Sam uh, with with uh, Yor at all. He's mostly on healing duty here, unfortunately. Okay, here we go. 147 MP. Hyogen should be safe, I think. Yeah, everybody's still at like 200 range. So that's a good idea. How? Oh, nice. Poisoned! Nice. And yours confused. That's, that's, uh, that's lovely. No, Yor! Ha <laughs> ha! Awesome. Wow. That was pretty good. You know what, just, just for fun, it, it will prob probably do nothing but gravity bomb! Oh, look at everybody's MP. Oh, that wasn't really needed, but oh well. Yeah, I didn't think that would work. But, it doesn't hurt to try. Longer poisons. Ah, don't confuse Sando. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> Weakling. Wonder. Oh wait, I can do that. Yeah, this music's pretty great. Uh, excuse me, healing? I don't think so.
I think that's what killed three guys last time. Three party members, what's that? Um. Okay. Then, we're going to do... That! Now you're blinding people, huh? Wow, that's pretty cool. I think... Celeste must have lost some attack power. That all you got? Okay. Hey! You can't do that! Oh. I just undid that! Check that out. Why do I get experience points? And treasure. I guess. <laughs>
impossible. Oh, back home. What was that? Oh? others. What? Well, that's slightly depressing. Was that the first relic? I forget. It's been so long.
Her manner, her manner of speaking is very different now that she's uh, a watcher or whatever. Hmm. That's it. Just gone. Hmm. I mean, physically, she is. Oh, is this what I think it is? Take my chances, raise time, in the book. I guess I'll put my gamepad down. Screw you, old man. I hope I don't get like a copyright strike for the song. <laughs> Oh, Feral. So are these all scenes from the past, or...? Oh, oh, this definitely isn't. Oh, Sus is watching. There she is again. I forget who she is. I think she was important when I was in that town, though. Oh god, this tower. Oh, I hated it. Is that the, uh, the prince? It's been a while. <laughs> I think, I think it was? the 
music. That's it. Um, I'll say yes, just so I can. Ah, look at that. She, she's back, everybody. Go here, and I'm gonna reset the game. Go here, and I'm going to see what happens when I pick the other decision, the other choice. To send my friends away instead of instead of fighting with them. I believe Ephim said it's the bad ending. I mean, when it's just this easy, I, I gotta see it. Your Celeste in the tower? Uh. Oh, was it before? Like an old version, you mean? That would make sense. Yeah, yeah, you go on that, you'll be a great god, I don't care. There. I'm surprised that FM has been so quiet since I defeat the final boss. Not even a congratulations or anything. I'm hurt. <laughs> All right, here we go. So instead of keep fighting, we're gonna send my friends away. Oh, there he is! <laughs> Had to enjoy the ending, yeah. Yeah, it seems like that's always what we're most proud of. Like with Black and Prophecy 2, I was most proud of the ending and that more than the rest of the game, I think. <laughs> But now I want to see what this bad ending is. I'm very curious. Is it going to be like Breath of Fire 4 where you fight the, your party? If you say... If you like side with the, uh, the boss? What do you write about? It's going to be one by one. Poor Sando, who's the first party member I got. Last but not least. I don't know how long this bad ending is, but I'll definitely give my thoughts on the game when this uh, bad ending is finished. I'm kind of holding off on that.
I hear you, Yor. I wouldn't know either if somebody did that to me. After everything that you would have been through together. And then they're just like, you know what? Goodbye. <laughs> so what happens here? Is it just over? Or is there a fight? The Star of Hope. Hmm. Oh, that's it! <laughs> no actual ending, okay. So, I guess that's it. I was hoping th there'd be a little bit more to the, the bad ending, but that's fine. Um, overall, I have to say I really enjoyed this. I probably enjoyed about... I would say between 90 to 95% of the game. Um, I think there were only a few areas I wasn't really fond of. Like that tower was one because I got really confused there because there was like a secret tunnel that I had to go through to actually proceed or something like that. It was so vague. Uh, I, I didn't like that tower. <laughs> um, trying to think if there was really anything else that... I think in the last stream I mentioned, and I think somebody else in the chat did too who's watching, uh, that there's a lot of encounters. Like at the start... No, that was on Discord. It was on Discord. Yeah. At the start of the game, it's very, very manageable, like the, the dungeons. I actually had a lot of fun clearing the dungeons like of every encounter so I could get that optional treasure at the end. But the further I went in, there were just so many fights in every dungeon, and I, I didn't have the, uh, the willpower to go through all that. <laughs> um, would that happen in the final dungeon? I wonder. I'm not going to have to go find out, but... Yes, I did the accomplishment. That was a uh, that was a fun journey. I wish I could have ended on the last stream to make it like one solid year, start to finish. But uh, close enough. Just a few days off. Um, yeah, that was really enjoyable. Uh, I'll I'll probably do a, a review on RMed at some point because I try to do that with the games that I finish. It, I did it with Legends of Valerian 2, but it took me a few months <laughs> to crank it out. Um, I'll try to do it sooner with this game so it's still a little bit fresh in my memory. I'd probably say um, I'll probably give it 4 or four 4.5 stars. Something like that, I think. Because it was really enjoyable, and uh, the balance was great start to finish. Like, I never felt like the game got too easy or too hard. Um... I more or less always knew where to go. I think there was only one time I was like, what do I do now? And that was... When was that? That's when I went to the kingdom you are came from. With a port town. At one point, I didn't know where to go. They said, go to the mine or something like that. I think it was the mine. But I didn't really know where it was. And the map felt kind of confusing up there because it branched off in so many different directions. Ah, oh, reviews don't take that much effort. I mean, considering how much time I put into playing the game, uh, I don't know how long the playlist is for the game, for Let's Play. It's probably, God, what, between, probably around 20 hours, I would probably guess, at least. Because I had, uh, how, how many parts to this? I don't know what one this is. It's like mid-20s, though, I think. Yeah. 
So yeah, there will be a review. Um, that was a satisfying ending. It was kind of depressing though, too, because, you know, of Celeste leaving. But it's nice that she was still there, watching over them. They couldn't, you know, speak to her, or be with her, or interact with her, but... I suppose they would take some comfort knowing that she was still there in some form, and she was still able to watch over them. So that, that's nice. Um... Also what? Also? Also? I'm waiting. <laughs> Come on, don't, don't leave me on a cliffhanger here. Vero actively worked to make Celeste into a god to watch over his people. However... You know, I kind of get that looking back, though. Because Veryl didn't really s stand in her way. Huh. Yeah, I think overall I'm very, uh, I'm very happy with that. Um... Yeah, the ending was good. Uh, very good use of the uh, the song you had there too. I like that that song with the, the vocals. I don't know if we'll get a like a, a warning from YouTube about it or not, but if I do, I don't care. I've got like thousands already. Basically, every single time I stream, I get one or two at least. Humanity just assumed it was. Oh. Okay, so the savior has nothing to do with humanity, huh? All right, cool. Yeah, four, four point five out of five. Probably write a review next week sometime. And then, I need to fill this void in my Let's Play schedule with another game. I don't know what that's even going to be. I haven't looked around Iron Man. Um, but I'm sure there's some good ones out there. Some good quality games. Of course there are. I don't really want to do any of the big games that won, like, all those uh, Mizios or got, like, featured game or anything like that. I just, I just like playing little games that either nobody really knows about, or you've heard about it, but nobody really talks about them. Like Chronicles of Sufnubra, uh, the Legends of Alarian games. Like, you hear about them on RMN, but you don't really, you know, hear about them. People don't really rave about them or talk about them much. So I'll, I'll look for another game like that. Nightbl Nightblade's been around for years, but I've never played any of his games. I should do that. I mean, I could always, just for fun, dig up Follow Mortis 2 and try to understand what the hell that game's trying to say to me. I think that was completed years and years ago. <laughs> but, yeah, so I can take this robe off. So I think I'm good. I'm good now. It's not so cold in here. Take my robe off. Now I still have my shirt and pants on, at least, thank god. I'm not, like, naked or anything. It was just so cold, I had to wear, like, multiple layers. It was so stupid. Ooh, I feel a little bit of a... little bit more of a chill now, though. Now that I took the robe off. Well, Philo Mortis, you're done. I mean, <laughs> Philo Mortis! Chronicles of Supernubra, you're done! Oh god, I hope Ephim didn't make Philo Mortis. God! That'd be horrible. Oh, so I guess it's just... That's it with that.